everybody and welcome to today's video. I'm super excited to unbox not one but two BoxyCharm base boxes for you all for December. I literally edited, uploaded my Monday video for you all. Maybe this will go up tonight, maybe not. It'll go up tomorrow, Tuesday, but... Either way, I just finished editing, uploading that video for you all, and boom, FedEx showed up with my BoxyCharm base boxes for December. So I'm gonna go over them with you all, give you all my thoughts, my opinions, all of that. And uh, before we jump into today's video, if you are new here, hi, hello, and welcome. My name is Rhonda, and over here, we're all about embracing the hot mess. It's a judgment-free, drama-free, stress-free zone, and if you can't keep it cute or put it on mute, you don't need to be here. Sissy pants are engaged. Let's go ahead and jump on in. I've got my Halo hair extension in by Gugu Hair, and I'm so in love. So this was a surprise, as always. So I don't have the um, the weight of the boxes. So the first one that we open, I will go ahead and give you all the weight. Comes to 14 pounds, eight ounces. All right. So jumping right in, we do have a little card in here, and. For December, it's the Gift of Glam. This is really pretty. It draws me in because it's pink, but nobody cares what I think. So, anywho, on the other side, you're going to see all the information about each item in the box, retail value, all of that. So, the first item that I see in here is a full-size product, and this is by Mud Masky, the Mineral Infused Double Cleansing Mask. So, a little information about this. This has a retail value of $59. This is a non-foaming fragrance fragrance-free cleansing mask. It's infused with rich minerals to detoxify and to deep cleanse your face before bedtime. Formulated with a blend of cleansing minerals and Mudmaski Signature Premium Moroccan Lava Clay. Hmm. Okay. And its effective formula aids in restoring your skin's pH levels, reducing redness, oh, and preventing acne. I feel like this is going to be fabulous for me. So moving into the next item. Now, this was actually a choice item, but this was sent to me in PR. So I did not get to make a pick or choice or what have you. It's you get what you get and you don't throw a fit. And I'm totally okay with that. So this is the Algenis formulated uh, triple algae eye renewal balm. Now, I actually did pick this in my particular box as well which I've not received yet, but it is a full-size product. I did forget to mention that the December box is when the the new price went into effect. So this box is $27.99, so let's just say 28 bucks. So you are getting a full-size eye cream or renewal balm, whatever you wanna call it. It does have a retail value of $68. It's a targeted eye treatment with enhanced algae technology, clinically shown to help reduce dark under eye circles, biogs, puffiness, lines, wrinkles, and crow's feet in just 10 days. Well, I will definitely be testing this out starting tonight, and I'll do like a before and after. And uh, make sure you're following me over on Instagram because that's where I'll be posting it. So, anywho, it does amazing things. It's formulated with their patented and exclusive. It's a blend of red, brown, and green algae. And it's supposed to work to energize and increase skin luminosity. Down for that. Retail value, $68. So... I mean, we're kind of doing really good, but we're definitely seeing the skincare in this box. Uh, the next item in here is by Wish, I think is how you say it. And this is the Vanilla Bean Lip Mask. And this has a retail value of $32, dang. And it is a good full-size product right here. I am curious if you can smell the vanilla. Okay, I don't really smell it. Ooh. Okay, let's see here. Ooh, that is really nice and like creamy feeling. I've got a bunch of gloss on, so I don't, it's not going to cut through the gloss, but 
I really, okay, don't believe my sniffer because half the time it, it's broke, it doesn't work, and it's just here for looks. But this does feel really nice. I mean, it doesn't feel as thick as like a Laneige, but it definitely feels like it's going to be hydrating. So I'm not upset with receiving that. Like I said, $32 value, and it just talks about, are your lips missing the moisture they crave and desire the vanilla bean lip mask? It's rich, it's buttery, it's smooth, and it melts deep into your lips as you sleep. I'm okay with it, so there's that. All right. However, I still feel it's very skincare heavy. All right, this next item is by Sophia and Mabel, the Satin Powder Highlighter in Peach Sangria. Now, this has a retail value of $22. Ooh, this is a dark looking highlighter. Always feel the need to sniff it. Um, maybe it could be, yeah, this would have to be like for my eyes for sure. Oh, that is gorgeous though. I mean, it is a beautiful highlighter, but unfortunately way too deep for my skin tone. I guess maybe you could use this as like a, a blush topper. I think it'd be really pretty with the NARS Orgasm maybe. I don't know, that could be a little, a little too much. I do have on the Ofra Winter Winter Glam blush, and this actually it may kind of go together really pretty now that I'm thinking about it. This is in the Rendezvous shade. Actually, those could be really pretty paired together. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. I will make this work with... I'll just put this matte blush on by Ofra and then put this highlighter with it as a blush topper. That'll be gorgeous. That'll be beautiful. See how we can make things work. I could have easily gotten really snippy about it, but you, you just multitask your products. You know what I mean? Okay, let's not get it all over my outfit. So a little information about this highlighter. Retail value $22. It says it's your secret weapon. The satin powder highlight applies lightly but builds with ease. Brings a blinding glow wherever you apply it. I mean, also, other than your eyes, you could also put it on like your shoulders too. But yeah, for me, it's a it's definitely too dark. So we're gonna just keep it as a blush topper. And last but not least, we have the Seraphine Botanicals Water Resistant Liquid Eyeliner. It's a Luna liner. And it was funny because when I was sneak peek swollen, these things for y'all, y'all were like, some of you guys were like, mm, I'm not excited about a liner. But then one of y'all were like, okay, I'm the oddball out. I love these things. And I get you, girl. Like, Haley loves to get liquid liners. So you're not alone. My daughter loves to get liquid liners too. Unfortunately for me, I really just don't use liquid liners. I just use my Makeup Geek pencils on my tight and waterline, but I don't do anything like on the lid. That's just me. So, anywho, let me tally this box up for you all right quick. Okay, so everything in this box, I feel like I didn't tally it up right, which it's possible. $27.99, and everything in here, if you had bought it individually, came to $199. So, all right, I'm gonna wait until the end of the video to tell you like my thoughts and opinion and all of that. All right, let's go ahead and go into the weight of the second box. Okay, now this one comes to 14.1 ounces. So jumping in, of course, we do have our card giving us all the information of everything in the box. And again, this was set over in PR as well. Now the first item in here was the choice item, and this is the Algenist Eye Balm. Again, retail value of $68. And of course, I mean, I could pull it out, but as we know, it's the full size, and it's apparently promising amazing things. Next in here is the Studio Makeup Hyaluronic Acid Rejuvenating Serum. Again, a full size product. This has a retail value of $45. In all honesty, I have learned hyaluronic acid, put it all over your body as well. Then put your lotion on top and lock it in. I mean, this is a good size and I will be doing that as well <laughs> because you just, you just can't beat it. So this serum is perfect for all ages. It's highly concentrated hyaluronic acid rejuvenating serum works to quickly reverse the effects of dehydration, loss of elasticity while keeping the skin highly moisturized throughout the day, leaving the skin looking radiant and youthful. Like I said, if you don't want to use this on your face, use it on your body, lock it in with your lotion. That's something that I've been doing with my Necessaire products. I love that. 
that that hyaluronic serum amazing all right the next item in here is by our Araceli beauty and i told you all i was like meh about it unless they were really good and i do believe this is a brand that is new to boxy this has a retail value of 24 dollars i am happy okay i know you're not really supposed to break the seal until you're ready to use the package or the the items but i can tell you i'm gonna be very happy and pleased with these because i told you all in our sneak peek spoilers if this is gonna like make me feel like i'm punching my face i'm not interested but it is very very soft very similar to like a, a beauty blender or the beauty bakery so that's that's the texture, that's the feel of it, and I will definitely be using these. Next in here is the Seraphine Botanical Luna Liner, water resistant liquid liner again. Retail value, I think I forgot to tell you all, it does have a retail value of $18. And then last in here is the Benefit Cosmetics Georgia Peach Blush. And this has a retail value of $30. This smells so good. It's a beautiful, beautiful blush. I'm not upset about it. I mean, if you don't have it, it is a very pretty blush to have. So there is that. So let me go ahead and tally this box up for y'all and then we'll go ahead and go into my final thought. Okay, so again, $27.99. Everything came to a total of $185 in this box. Honestly, okay, my first thought is I really expected to loathe, if that's the right word, the base boxes for December. I really was expect. I was like, mm, nothing's got me really excited. I don't know how I'm going to feel about this, but I think I'm going to go ahead and give it to the first box because this has me very intrigued and I was kind of wanting that lip mask. So in all honesty, I feel like the only item I'm not going to use in here is probably, well, obviously the, the, liner but when i ugh, the only reason i'm not like hooting and hollering over it is probably because i already have this and then i know i won't use the liner you know what i mean so i think when it comes down to it yeah i'm gonna give it to variation one i feel like the filler products i will be honest like this does not have me uber excited but i was excited to be able to figure out how to multitask it but I don't think the filler products are that bad. I don't know. Maybe I'm just having a really good mental health day and I'm not being negative. I don't know. <laughs> Let me know y'all's thoughts down below. Which variation of this base box did you prefer? Would you like to receive? Now I'm going to be back with the premium and the luxe unboxing for you all. I will be back with my paid for box as well. Wouldn't say, now don't get me wrong, this is not my favorite base boxes that I've ever received. I mean, y'all have seen me in the past unbox some boxes where I am freaking geeking, losing my mind, annoying the, you know what, out of y'all. So this is not it. But like I said, I really expected these to be huge misses for December. <laughs> So expectation versus reality, I'm a, I'm a little pleased with that. So anyways, if you are interested in my top, my cami, my hair, I will have everything linked and listed down below. I will be back to go over the choices for you all for the base as well as the premium for January because as of right now, the choice window is now open. You can log into your account and make your picks for January and then you can do a little shopping. Don't forget to check me out on my second channel, Hot Mess Mama Blogs for Plus Size curvy girl fashion hauls over there i'm on tiktok and instagram at hot mess mama of four and until next time i'll catch y'all in the next video kisses from kentucky Mwah. bye